this is Cheryl. I'm going to show you today how to fix a miscrossed cable. I, after I finished my back and posted a picture on Facebook, as I'm looking at the picture on in the Facebook group, I see that I had a miscrossed cable. And it was way down here, where this orange safety pin is, is the spot where I decreased for the armholes. And I got all the way done, got all my neck shaping done, and I realized I had a miscross cable. So it was late at night when I saw it, and I thought, well, I'm just going to sleep on it. And I thought that for about 10 minutes, and then I knew it would bug me too much, and I probably wouldn't sleep that night unless I tried to fix it. Um, and there's a couple of ways that you can do that. You can actually cut the yarn somewhere in here, and, and rip back and fix it. Um, I don't like doing that just because um, then you've got edges to work in there and if you mess up then you may end up ripping back anyway, which isn't the end of the world. I mean, I, I could have done that. Um, but I thought I was going to just try and fix it doing kind of like a duplicate stitch. And that is what I did there. And I'm going to show you how to do that using a contrasting color yarn. I'll just do it right here in this section. Okay, so the way that we do that is to start from the back and we just want to be in the column that we're trying to fix. So I'm going to try and fix the rightmost column here and I want it to go over the top. I want this cable to go on top of this cable. So I'm going to go in and act like I'm making a stitch and I'll do the top stitch first and then go do the bottom stitch. So we're going to do a duplicate stitch and I'm going underneath this stitch and then I'll come back in. And exactly where you put this hole is kind of up to you. You may have to do it more than once to uh, get it exactly how you like it. Now I'm going to do the stitch below that. And this one will come underneath the two stitches that, or the two legs of the stitch that I just put in previously. And then you go back in the same hole that you came out of. There we go. So that's the right column. You know, there's two stitches, two columns in this cable. Now we'll do the second one. And you know, obviously it blends in much better if you're using the same yarn as you are on the sweater. It's not a super difficult procedure, especially if you've done duplicate stitch, maybe in color work or something like that on another project. And you just are using the anatomy of, the, of a stitch to guide you. And you kind of know what that is from all your other knitting. Okay. So there we go. We've made the cable look like it's going on top. This one is going on top of this one now. And see, there's a top, top, top. So obviously that's wrong, but I'm just doing that for demonstration purposes. Hopefully I don't have any other miscrossed in my sweater. At least I have not found them yet if I do. If you have any questions, just send me a message. Thanks.